Kids and adults with Down syndrome had the opportunity to hit the court today and work on their basketball game. News 9 Cameron Joyner talked to a family who says the basketball camp is the highlight of their summer. For a lot of kids, summer means basketball camp, but the coach at this camp wanted to bring that opportunity to a whole new community. It's not what they can't do, it's what they can do. Dribbling, shooting, and just having fun. They're just great athletes, too. Simple, but impactful. They're, they're so appreciative, they're so loving, they're, they enjoy the sport. Yeah! She constantly asks, like, when is it going to be basketball camp again? Because she just enjoys it so much. This is Ashley Propritas and her daughter. Can you say hi, Abby? Hi. They attend the Down Syndrome Association of Central Oklahoma basketball camp every summer. Woo! Yes. We love that they can come and work on skills that they don't typically have the opportunities to do at other camps. The camp is a safe space. For our community, there's not as many that exist out there. But she says there's a reason this camp stands out. Coach Jerry is fantastic. He is so good at relating to the kiddos, understanding where they need to be pushed and what they need to do or they need a little break. And understands that each athlete is different. Yeah, Abby works better when she's motivated this way or this works best for Abby to, you know, to get her to do her drills and stuff. And I think it just gives them some place to call their own, really. A place to focus on their strengths. A lot of people don't work with this kind of community or population, so not really understanding the capability instead of the incapability of what they can do. Perspective is everything to Coach Jerry. You know, and I get caught up in the execution of camp and, and look at them. They, they could care less what we do. You know, they just want to have a good time. This was the last day for camp, but Coach Jerry says they will be back next year for their 10-year anniversary. In Oklahoma City, I'm Cameron Joyner, Oklahoma's own News 9.